My name is Edmond Baganese. I'm doing medicine at the National University of Rwanda. I'm, uh, I'm Rwandese by nationality, and my family is living in Kigali. I'm the coordinator of the Rwanda Village Concert Project since two years ago. And I started to be involved in the Rwanda VCP since uh, four years ago. The Rwanda Village Concert Project is a, an international student land project aimed to provide improvement in the living uh, or in the underprivileged communities. And also it is working to build the capacity of students in development and in research work. We are divided into two groups. They are the national group, coordinating group, and the international coordinating group. Our national coordinating group is based in Ibutale, in Rwanda, and our international coordinating group is based in Germany. To achieve our goals, uh, we are dividing our work into micro-projects and initiatives. So up to now we have five micro-projects and two initiatives. We have uh, malaria prevention, HIV education, family planning and reproductive health education. We have hygiene and sanitation. Uh, we have income generation and we have climate project. Initiatives, you have the WEF Center Capacity Building Initiative and the RCCM Offer Center Support Initiative. The idea of Rwanda VSP started in 1998. Uh, then we started the Bayesian survey. And in 2000, we started the field work. The idea of Rwanda Village Concert Project was based on a community health in Huye and it was started uh, between a partnership uh, of Medical Student Association of the National University of Rwanda and the IFMC, that is International Federation of Medical Student Associations. They came up with idea to help the people from Huye who were resettled there after the 1994 genocide. We did the Bayesian survey from 1998 to 2000, then we started the field work. All the micro projects and initiatives are learning. The Labit project is still learning. Uh, we have the coffee growing project that is learning and the, the education programs are also learning. We have now so far reached more than 6,000 people with the education on malaria. We have reached two schools with education on malaria and hygiene and uh, we have been able to organize three pyramid workshops where around 150 uh, students from high schools in the southern province of Rwanda as a tent and now they are, have their own clubs in their schools. Um, we have been able uh, to learn other uh, the Huye district and the Huye sector. Now you have six uh, youth clubs that we have formed. Apart from the education programs, we have uh, other income generation activities with the youth clubs in the community. We have the LICE project and now we are starting the Labit learning project uh, the tomatoes project is learning, the drama group project is learning, and also the fish project is going to start soon. Uh, we are planning also to learn the beekeeping project with the women, the widows from the Huye sector. They're going to soon start. And in the future, now the education program has been successful, so we want now them to implement their own project. We want to start like a fund, a supporting funds for the project so that the people can easily get access to the funds and learn their own project. This will only provide capacity in management and in implementing those projects.